You have a stone cold life. Mr. Van Peck, you have two minutes, please. Thank you so much. Uh, thank you for giving the opportunity to speak. Uh, it's, it's really hard to follow up Council of Mercy, but I'm, I'm going to try. Uh, my name is Van Peck, and the uh, topic tonight is civic improvement and code enforcement. Uh, on the topic of civic improvement, we can improve roads and signs for pedestrians and people, bicycles, so people walking, riding bikes, and driving cars can use the streets together. Poor or damaged signs make people use the air less and can attract crimes. Better or improved signs and streets can make the, the block look friendlier, inviting increased good morale for the neighborhood. Uh, we could also improve uh, empty storefronts in the city by working with property owners to advertise services like Lowe's United Team Quality Center, the Boys and Girls Club, uh, Lowe's Community Health Center, and, and other volunteer opportunities and local businesses in Lowe's. Most of these organizations and services provide either free, free year services or uh, services that help improve the quality of life for all residents. Uh, we need to work with the landlords, banks, business owners, and nonprofits so these empty storefronts will be put into good use and make less of an eyesore and more attractive for our residents and visitors. Uh, on the topic of code enforcement, uh, we, could, we were doing a good job, uh, but we can also improve on maintaining empty buildings and vacant lots by, by keeping the lawns mowed, uh, trees and bushes trimmed, and the physical appearance of the building look, look presentable. Uh, so it doesn't present uh, much of an eyesore and, and it can deter from illegal activities in the area. Uh, on, on, the, on topic of uh, code enforcement, uh, we need to uh, spread information to residents about code enforcement through such means as uh, uh, through like inserts through electric gas bills or through emails to keep residents properly informed or, or through workshops uh, held at different locations throughout the city. Uh, if you want to hear any more about me, please, uh, I'll be here for a while at fanpackforcity.com. Hello, uh, again, it's really hard to follow the constant merch, I'm going to try. Uh, uh, infrastructure and code enforcement, it's, uh, it's a big issue. And, uh, you know, I know the city and everyone <laughs> and the partnerships have made great strides to improve it. But uh, these, these are issues that I've been hearing from people. And, uh, and I think we could, we could improve it more. And uh, you know, if, if given an opportunity, you know, I want to work in collaboration, partnership with different businesses, organizations, uh, with, with our state state reps, just just to improve uh, infrastructure and code enforcement in the city. And uh, to me, the city council is about a team P working together. Uh, that's why there's nine city councilors. And um, if given the opportunity and the privilege, you know, I know I can be a great addition to the team. And uh, I hope to have one of your nine votes on November 8th. And uh, I'm number 17 on the ballot. Thank you.